what's up everyone welcome back to another video and in this one we're going to be going over how to perform a factory reset on your samsung galaxy a53 5g so let's begin with the video now Welcome to Search Tech. Our mission is to help you get the most out of your tech through reviews and tutorials. If that is something you're interested in, make sure to subscribe and don't forget to hit that bell to get notified when we release a new video. And there's going to be useful links below in the description covering everything that we discuss in this video. With that being said, let's get right into it. So first of all, a factory reset is going to remove all user data from a device and reverts it back to default settings or to be more exact, returns it to the way it was when you first purchased the device. We're going to have two ways to do it and the first one will be through our settings while having the password or no password at all. The second one will be in case you don't know or remember the password and you have no way to access your settings menu. So the first method we want to do is unlock our device and then we're going to head to the settings menu. Right here we're going to scroll down to general management and select at the bottom reset. After that we will select factory data reset where we will see some warnings about everything that will be erased and then we're going to go on reset and delete all. All you have to do after is just wait for the process to finish. Now, if you can't access to your device because you forgot your password, then what you want to do is press and hold the power button for about 20 seconds while also pressing the volume down key until the phone turns off. Once our device is turned off, we're going to switch immediately to holding the volume up and the power key for a couple of seconds. When the Samsung logo is displayed, release the buttons and move through the menu with the volume up and down keys until you reach the recovery mode option. Then you're going to press the power button to access and with the volume buttons go to the option white data slash factory reset. Here you're going to press the power button to enter and a screen with many no and yes will appear with the volume keys again. Go to the yes and press with the power key. After finishing again with the volume keys click on reboot system after you wait for all that process and then press the power key of your Samsung Galaxy and then the device will reboot and take several minutes to start while restoring the device to its factory state. So we just have to wait for that. Alright, and as you can tell, the phone has been completely restored to its factory conditions. Alright everyone, so that was it for today's video. If you got some valuable information out of it, please don't forget to give it a like and also leave a comment down below on what you think. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to receive notifications every time we post a new video. And as always, I'll be seeing you in the next one.